Hi, I'm David Aldrich and I'm an automation specialist at the Reynolds Company. I am very pleased to share this video done by my counterpart at McNaught McKay, Mike Brennan. He is going to discuss how to troubleshoot a GuardMaster safety relay. On each GuardMaster safety relay there are three LEDs. The first LED, the power fault LED, is currently green. That status shows that there is power to the safety relay. The second light is the input light. That shows that the input device is wired to the relay and that its signals are currently high. The third LED is the output LED. That LED shows the status of the relay contacts inside the safety relay. In the current configuration, I have an e-stop wired to a safety relay. When I depress the e-stop, you'll notice the input and output LEDs turn off as expected. When I release the e-stop, the input and output LEDs turn back on. This box will introduce a channel-to-channel -channel short. You notice when I introduce the short, the power LED, which was once green, is now flashing red. This tells us that there's a fault in the system. When I depress and release the e-stop again, you'll notice the safety relay will try to reset, but will go back into the fault state. What I need to do now is fix the wiring. I'll do that by fixing the channel to channel short and I'll need to depress and release the e-stop again, resetting the safety relay. Thanks for watching. For more information, give us a call or visit our website.